Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Imperion Galactic Survival. I am Zystars, and we are still on the Star Salvage mod. Now, it's about time. I think it's about time that we took a look at one of these ghost ships. So not only are we going to do that, but there is a mission related to it. We also have this one. So let's activate you. Okay, now... I don't think we're going to do medical. I think we're going to unlock 500 bonus points because we kind of need that stuff for more things and stuff because we there are so many things we don't have. It is bananas. Ghost ship. Let's see. Now, I'm pretty sure... Where is it? Now, I don't know what this does, but we get a bunch of cool stuff for it. All right, receiving transmissions. Let's see. Oh, Oh, that's interesting. Ah, greetings. We are Polaris Space Industries. I've heard of you. Let's see. We'd like to offer you opportunity to make some credits, increase reputation with Polaris. Okay. I'm sure you've heard of rumors of past few years. Ghost ship sightings have been on the rise. This increase in activity is most inhabitants of the galaxy worried, but not us. Polaris Industries has decided we want to learn all we can about these haunted wrecks so we can reduce panic by finding a way to utilize the strange energy that animates these junk vessels. We want you to locate a ghost ship, scan its energy signature, and see if you can find what animates these derelicts. We will keep the communication frequencies open. Okay, that's good. Um, contact, okay. Great, look forward to working with you. Alright, okay, so... Polaris, huh? So there's two things that have happened. Number one, we kind of scooted away into Xeraxian space because we want to fight some Xeraxians. Um, number two, we have two ghost, three ghost ships in this area. We have the Possessed Barracuda and two vanilla ghost ships. I have also armed myself. Oh, which reminds me, we need to set turrets. Because we are going to... Let's see, capital vessels, thrusters, turrets, oops, uh, thrusters. I don't think these ghost ships have guns on them. But, you know, they might. What the hell do I know? So the idea is going to be to get in and destroy the thrusters on this thing. Maybe. We'll see what it, what it wants us to do. But we should be able to get in, destroy the thrusters, and then that should allow us to get down and um, get down and get busy with, with kicking this thing. Let's see. Fridge 3. Get a little food in us. I made some more scout rifles. Rifle rounds. We also don't need the paint gun. I also made the heavy combat armor. So 400 armor rating. Oh, you know what? Probably going to want to switch to the environmental suit. But we'll worry about that once we get closer to the ship. If we decide to get out. A trading station is white, so it's probably just a destroyed one. Okay, ghost ship. What has this thing got us doing? Okay, there's not a whole lot of information. Let's see. Oh, yeah. It's going to destroy the thrusters. Which is too bad, because thrusters are good loot, but... It just says locate a ghost ship. Here, let's get in behind this thing. Um, is it moving? It's not moving. I don't... Oh, it doesn't have any rear thrust. Oh, this ghost ship's been for schnickered already. <laughs> okay. I mean, I don't know where my guns are shooting. There are no thrusters on this thing. Oh, there we go. They're on the bottom. There we go. Okay. Whoa. Yeah, my up thrust is not great. Uh, let's go around it. Here we go. Let's get these medium thrusters off. No? That's a thruster. That's a thruster. Is there anything on the front? I need some... Is that the core? No. 
Does this thing have an easily... Okay, all the thrusters are gone. That means I should be able to get in here and do something with it. So let's flip the ship around. This back end here looks about right. My rockets... My alien... Oh, I didn't turn them on, did I? No. That's okay, we didn't end up needing them. Okay, let's even us out. And... Okay. We should have plenty of warning should the uh, other a other ships show up. And let's activate these just in case we need the extra umph. Alright, let's head down to the... Uh, cargo bay will grab we're gonna leave the gravity generator off because that will create problems when we're in the ship um, armor and boosts grab the combat EV throw that actually we don't need that one what's what do we like outside it's cold as hell but we'll be fine there and our radiation is good all right let's let's see if we it says locate a ghost ship I've located one. I'm not sure why can I... Nope, okay. Uh, it's not really letting us... Hmm. Okay. Ectoplasm saturated fuel tank. I feel like we're going to need that for something. For this ectoplasm. Well, there's a lot of good stuff in here, but wait, I've seen this before. I've seen this before. There should be an elevator. I think one of the pirates made a base out of a station similar to this. Here we go. Oh no, here's the elevator. We go up here. Yep. Oh, no. Nah. How do we get out of this room? Come on, open the door. My master key. Uh, no. Could have swore it was right here. Oh, nice. Now, they might have... Pirates might have made changes to the ship. Where's the core? I want the core. Come on, baby. Well, there is more up, so let's... Let's go up and see if... I'm just on the wrong floor. Why is this door upside down? Oh, this is the cockpit. Oh, jeez. Other faction. Not for long. Okay, um, having a little trouble finding the core, so let's go in the uh, uh, butt end. Goodness gracious. Oh, I already busted a hole in this one. Uh-huh. Come on, baby. Engineering says it's deck one, which is probably where the core is. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Warning, airlock not pressurized. Okay, no, I've been in here. Where? All right, give me a few minutes. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I think I found the core. I was right about where it was. It's just on the pirate ships, or the pirate stations, they've cleared this area out and left the core exposed. That is not something that I'm going to do. Okay, so I'm wondering if because I already discovered these ghost ships, it doesn't want it doesn't let me complete the quest. I wonder. Because, well... I can't complete the quest. So let's link up with the Lobotopia. Uh, let's link up. Actually, let's just put everything in the... Oh, yeah, I have a bunch of crap in the harvest container. Look at all that. I went and explored the home system a bit and found a planet that was not allowing capital vessels but did allow... or did have a whole bunch of bridges and extenders. So that's good. That, that let me... Um, get a whole bunch of bridges and extenders for, for monetary purposes. Alright, let's turn this thing off. Okay, so it's got this ectoplasmic energy, which, from what I understand, we have to put in the fridge. 
So let's drop it in the finished fridge. Let's see if that's the case. All right, grab. Lobotopia. Okay, yeah, because it's got a it's got a uh, degrade timer, but it being in the fridge should mean, assuming my fridges are on, that it doesn't degrade. My fridges are not on because power consumption. All right, now we should have the be able to get these ectoplasmic fuel tanks. Pick them up. I want you. Actually, I probably should have just scavenged that. But here we go. Oh, son of a biscuit. Uh, harvest repository. Click. Okay, good. Some items, like the, uh, what do you call them? Oh, that just said, hey, look what I found. Some items, like the uh, statues, will just straight up disappear. Well, that was loud. Uh, click. They'll just straight up disappear on you. And that's no good. These are just saying fuel tanks. Yeah, these are just calling them fuel tanks. Hmm. That says ex ectoplasm saturated fuel tank. Okay, well, maybe they're just fuel tanks. And the ectoplasm, I think we have to use in that other thing. So let's uh, salvage that, salvage that. I told a guy those had flux coils in them. Okay, they do. Good. I didn't lie. We do need cobalt alloy, though. I found out I was looking at using railguns on the SV, and railguns use cobalt alloy for creating the ammunition. Okay, let's see. That's just a large constructor. Food processor. Oh, right. Bunch of ammo. Holy cow, this thing's got a ton of ammo. Well, not a ton. A bunch. No? Fridge? Sweet. Oh. I've got my food in this one for some reason. Okay, well, I think that'll do that ghost ship. So I wonder if that's the case. There's a cockpit. Oh, you know what? Can I fly it? No, this freighter cannot be controlled. <laughs> I was hopeful. <laughs> so I wonder if... I wonder if that's the case. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe we're going to have to fly into another star system to do this quest. I'm going to leave it active because... I have no... There are no other quests in this game. Or in this version because I'm playing on... What do you call it? I'm playing on uh, no no story. I play. I started a no story start. Which, if you don't want quests, do that. But if you do want quests and apparently more unlock points, don't do that. Because when you're doing the stories, what the? Oh shoot! There's another one. I only saw four before. Now there's now there's uh there's three more. But uh, yeah, you get more unlock points with with the stories. It's more of a hassle because you have to go through all of the story stuff. Some of it's redundant, but you do get more. Okay, let's... It just says locate a ghost ship. Why aren't these showing up on my HUD? Oh, there we go. <laughs> That'd be why. Alright, let's get close to this one and see what happens. And actually, let's shut off the rockets. We don't need them. Why is that on there? Oh, sweet. Okay. Initial scans are odd. I'd like to stop, please. Perhaps Polaris will have better luck to cipher. Transmit the data. Incoming transmission. Great. With the determined type of energies animating these husks, we'll contact you and have analyzed the data. Whoops. Take out the thrusters. Okay. Let's get back to the ghost ship because we overshot because I had inertia off. All right, let's do this thing. This is actually a better way to view. Most capital vessels, this is not a good way to do it. Man, these these thrusters are melting underneath my turret fire. Oh, there's another one. I don't even need to get involved. 
Let's see, what do we got here? Whoop, 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 too far. Uh, whoop. Flares Industries. We've analyzed the data and determined that the majority of the otherworldly energy is concentrated around the vessel's core. Once you've taken out all the ship's thruster and has come to a full stop, you should destroy the core of the vessel. Doing this will disrupt energy. Okay. Yeah, yeah, we did it already, but... Uh, let's pop the door. Oh. Fixed weapons. Let's pop the door. Oh, jeez, that was silly. There's the warp core. And, yep, there's a couple more thrusters. The thing with these ghost vessels, if you don't destroy the thrusters, and I think this is true of all capital vessels in this game, uh, and you try to run around inside, you'll kind of lose... You won't be able to get around. It's quite frustrating, so you definitely have to destroy the thrusters. I really need to put some spotlights on this thing. Where are we shooting, guys? What are we doing on ammo? Oh, we're down to 2,000. Okay, that looks like it. So this is the Exodus. Oh, pff, look at that giant hole. Wait, is that a hole? No. There's one, though. All right. Uh, let's make sure nothing is coming. Okay, I don't see exclamation marks. Whoa. What's that ghost ship doing? Hopefully he doesn't attack us. We'll turn rockets back on. Just in case. And if we hear if we hear things shooting, then we'll have to bugger out. Because that would be bad. Alright. Let's rotate just a little bit to get us in line. That should do it. Alright, let's get over there. But there wasn't anything in the last one. I'm sure there won't be anything in this one to attack us, but let's get the weapons ready just in case. All right, where was that entry point? Okay, we've got a big cargo bay. Hey, hey, it's a core. How convenient is that? And I got this nice, handy vehicle class sniper rifle. All right, determined the vessel's fuel tanks seem to have accrued some kind of buildup of pseudo-organic material. The material appears to emit some kind of energy that, if analyzed, may be able to be used to create some kind of fuel source. Collect a sample and bring it back to us. Sweet. Acquire ectoplasm. So let's drop a core in this baby. Here, we'll do this. We'll put it on the outside. And then we'll shut it off. Ooh, this has got some points. All right. Let's pull this number uh, back to the fridge input. No, the fridge finished. Okay. Um, that did not do it. Do I have to put it in my inventory? Oops. Sometimes you got to put it in your inventory. No? Um, how does one finish this quest? Because this is the only way I know how to get ectoplasm out of a ship. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh-uh. Okay. Um... Um, know it all. What do we do? I might have to wait for this one until I can get a hold of him. Let's grab this stuff. Uh -huh. Oh, man, we'll just eat that one. Okay, well, um, I wonder if this thing's got goodies in it like the last one did. Here, let's get this stuff off. Yeah, just a couple of these. I will always take those. And we will break down... Wait. Yeah, this is just a standard warp drive. Oh, hello. I will definitely take all of that. Harvest controller. And... Oh, what were these? Oh, ammo controllers. Oh, man, that sucks. Okay. I shouldn't have blown the back out like that. I should have used a smaller caliber weapon. 
Oh, those don't matter. Yeah, I'll take that. Those don't matter. Okay. Okay. Well, what in the heck is all of the CPU on this thing? Oh, it's got three RCS in it. Okay. Right, here's the fuel tanks. Ectoplasm saturated fuel tanks. Yeah, see, it's calling it those still. Maybe we need to go up to one of them. Here we go. I wonder if I needed to do it like this. What happens if I put fuel in here? Item not accepted. Okay. How about if I put this stuff back and then I pull it out? No? How about if I pull it out into my inventory? Shenanigans. There you go, ladies and gentlemen. You have to pull the fuel out of the tank into your inventory. Here's the ectoplasm slowly degrading. I recommend placing it in the fridge. Yep. This is so gross. Okay. So that's what you gotta do. You gotta you gotta put it into your fridge and it disappeared out of my inventory. So maybe I sent it. Use mission return in the player's trade station. Okay, maybe I I don't know. Gave it to them already? They better not try to take more. Does this ship have O2? Because I'll take that too. Excellent, ladies and gentlemen. So, hey, we got our ghost ship done. Um, now I think it's time to head on to one of these planets and see if we can find a couple Xeraxian stations to take down because, you know, taking down Xerax is kind of fun. And I want to see if we can get some good loot from them. Where did that core go? Okay, let's see if this planet lets me in. Oromo Swan. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Yeah, we are here. All right. Now, let's see if there are any Xerax. There are. Excellent. Man, there's all sorts of crap on this planet. Well, not really. There doesn't seem to be, at least not within range, like, I mean, there's wreckages, but there's no... There's no big PO or, um, fields of wreckage. Okay, let's go see what this is, and then let's and then we'll hit that. Here we go. Oh, we took a little bit of damage. I got close to that Orion. Yeah, look at that. Um, the, the Orion ghost ship, and it unloaded all holy hell, unholy hell on me. It was it was quite a thing. It was no good at all. Oh, it flies so well now that it's empty. Now that the cargo bay is empty. Man, this thing on that on the when I was scavenging the home the home system got so full of stuff. It was so sluggish. Come on, baby. There we are. I don't know where the core is, so we're gonna have to take down the turret. I don't see any dudes. The turret's not doing a lot damage. Holy cow, that was a lot. Alright, so let's take out that. And we'll take out... It doesn't look... Yeah, it does. Never mind, that was dumb. I was going to say it doesn't look on, but that obviously isn't right. I love the detail they put into these things with the tracked engines and everything. That is really cool. There we go. I was wondering when those guys would spawn in. Oh, yeah. Anybody ever done a turkey shoot? Because that's what that just was. Okay, are they going to spawn on this side? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I do love my turrets. All right. Let's hop out. Kill the thrust. All right, we got anything else? Oh, there's another one. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, gimme gimme. Gimme all your goodies. I love me some goodies. Anything over here? Nope. Filthy Xerax.
this is where you get tons of ammo for the standard weapons, which is really just going to be tons of ammo for my centric turrets. Oh, I hear something. Can't see me. There's a light in the way. Can't see me. I got a sniper rifle. Can't hurt me. I have heavy combat armor. Ooh, jeez. Yeah, get him. I don't really need relations with anybody. I'm honored with the ones that I care about, except for the... What's a jingers? And they... They suck. Oh my goodness, they're spawning more. You guys be bringing more Xerax in for me to kill? I appreciate that. Wait. I heard them. Oh, they're inside. How does one inside? Here we go. What? Other oh, faction. Oops. How many are in there? There's two? Looks like a laser gun. I like laser guns. That's a shotgun. As your ex weapons all look alike. Oh, that was nice of him. I mean, I'm not going to use a shotgun like ever, but... Maybe that's what I'll use with my unicart. <laughs> Might use a shotgun. Okay, well, that was a, a thing. There's the core. Uh, let's bring this to bear. The uh, bullets for this thing are pretty cheap. Whoa! Where did I see it? It was right behind these fuel tanks, right? Right in here? Yeah. There we go. There's explosive blocks right there. I'm curious if there's like a self-destruct mechanism or something on this one? I don't know. 10, 11? That's not bad. Okay, what do we got here? Um, uh, it's got a big antenna. Are we talking comm center? Yep, we're talking comm center. Hmm, we might need to bring turrets to bear. The SV probably doesn't have enough umph to take care of this, so let's switch to bases and turrets. Turrets? Turrets attack? How's our armor? Shields, not bad. Eh, we don't really turn that well. Okay, sweet, that's one. Really, we just need to get... Well, this side doesn't really have... an entry, does it? I wonder where the entry is. Here we go. Alright, hit those ones. Stop shooting that. Change targets, come on, baby. go. These small number of turrets don't really have a chance. Alright, let's... Oh, I probably should have landed elsewhere, but whatever. Oh, heavy armor. Ugh. What do we got? I was planning on going in here, but if I have to be able to jump... Come on, me. No? Are we not jumping today? Come on, baby. There we go. All right, what do we got? Where the hell did you come from? I'm loving the scout rifle. It's got the attack speed of the minigun, but way more damage per round. Oh, the pulse rifle, too. The pulse rifle attacks at 600 RPMs. But this thing uses scout ammo instead of laser ammo, which is good. The only, the only limiting factor is those shells. We've got to remember to keep buying them from the Polaris. These guys are level one. Oh, there's a, there's a thing. There's a thing pointed straight down. Oh, this is nice. Oh my goodness, this armor. Why did I not do this sooner? Oh yeah. Because I didn't have... 
I didn't have armor boosts. It took two armor boosts and a oxygen boost in order to get this one. Well, from the medium, and then what, it was an armor boost and an oxygen boost to go from light to medium. I've got 4,000 more rounds in addition to what I got here, just because this weapon's so much fun. Delta shooter. Hey, get back here. Alright, come on, baby. I don't actually need to, anything in here, so I can just freely destroy everything. Hey, Xerax, I was right here, dummy. I'll take that. That's going into the wrong repository, though. Okay, can I get in? No? Of course I can. Now, I think a couple of spawns pop up in here. Maybe not. Alright, let's switch to the Lobotopia Harvest Repository. Might as well grab the good booty while we're in here. Um, this also counts as the good booty. Yep, see? 17 fuel packs. Psh. This uh, CV does run through some fuel with all those large engines, so... Finding fuel is good. I think I just... I think I dumped like 40% was like 700 Promethium fuel packs, so... Quite a thing. Okay, I guess we're going up here. No gun turrets. There's a lever. Xerexian scum. Give me your lasers. Give me your giblets. Nice. Nice. I like the laser rounds. I do like my laser gun, too. What are we up to now? 669. Yes, I'm a child. All right. That was that side. Can we just get in here? Oh. 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 That's what we call the kablammy. Well, I blew something up. Eh, shoot your kneecaps out. You didn't need those, did you? Oh, he was a little tougher than his buddies. I wish I had a grenade I could just roll down the stairs. Boy, this armor sure spoils you, though... We are going to... Run out of food rather quickly, so when I fly around, I need to switch to my environmental suit. What's that do? <laughs> that opens the doors. Ow, someone's shooting me. Who shot me? Where'd you guys come from? Ho oh, ho, there's a whole bunch of dudes. Come on, baby. Oh, hey, what's up? You guys have to be kidding me with this AI. What's up, buddy? Uh-huh. Are there custom uh, custom PO or mod specific rateable land based POIs? I know there's a lot in space. But is there anything on land? You know? Because the land POIs are awesome. Okay, that's doing that nonsense again. Yes, yeah, it sure it certainly is. What was that? Oh, that was my ship. Oh, my goodness gracious. Hello, I'll take that. Ooh, that was a sniper guy. That could have been bad if it was a higher level POI. That is a problem with these fast shooting guns. The reload rate is real. The struggle's real. Okay. Oh, there is a hallway here. Oh, that is a lot of Delta shooters. 
Ooh, that was weird. Got a little framey there for a minute. There's another one, right? There we go. Okay, I'm taking a little bit of damage. Nothing terrible. Where's the core in this place? Oh, sadium. Hell yeah. I will take all the sadium. Okay, that's just an oxygen oxygen storage area. Okay, some fuel. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, is there anything over there? What is that? Deco vent. Oh, I've already been down here. Oh, that's a... Yeah. Oh, goodness. Get off of there. Okay, so not really anything here. Oh, yeah, we are eating through food like it is going out of style. Okay, so there's the drawback of this heavy armor, or at least this heavy armor with this boost, is we go through food like it's... like it, Oh. Holy crap, there's more of them. Oh, they're respawning. The spawners are persistent. Okay, what about these wardrobes? Oh, that's garbage. Is that a snipey do? Yeah, it is. That'd be worth some money. I need to find a buyer for the Xeraxian weapons. It, it may be that only the Xerax will buy the Xerax weapons. In which case, it's garbage. Garbage for me. It's all just a bunch of crap. Okay, so we gotta go down here. Oh, hey guys. Yeah, my mistake for not killing the spawners. What? Another one? Come on, baby. Okay. Now we'll take this out. So that doesn't happen again. Oh my god, so many of these guns. Uh, I guess we'll go this way. Uh-huh. Oh, that guy took a few hits. Oh, sugar honey iced tea. Come on, baby. There we go. Nope, we're out of ammo. Or, not out of ammo, we're out of space. Go. Okay, let's get in here. Oh! Alright, I'm gonna pick up a little more carefully now. I'm not taking those guns. They are annoying to drop. Alright, uh... Other faction. That's just the exit. Alright, so we're gonna blow this door. Come on, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Uh-huh. Oh, Delta Shooter. Yeah. Let's see. Fuel room. Who's shooting in the fuel room? Flip the switch. Oh! Damn, I wish I had a rocket launcher. Oh, wait a minute! Wait just one damn minute. Uh-huh. I have an epic plasma cannon. I'm not sure where I got that from. But I have this. We don't need a blonger right now. Okay. Do I just fire? Oh. oh my goodness gracious me. <laughs> Wait a minute. Is this like the best weapon in the game? Oh, I blew the core. So, there's no aim, but it does a thousand friggin' damage. Does it? And it blows down doors. 
It has no reload. I just blew up the fuel. That was stupid, you dummy. Oh, man. Okay, except for the obvious problems with the, uh... Blowing up the fuel. Whoa, 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 whoa. Who the hell is shooting rockets at me? What? Where? What? Anyway, with the obvious, obvious exception of blowing up things like the fuel, this, uh... This, uh, parasitic plasma thingy is pretty badass. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. That is going to have to cut this episode. We went a little bit long, but that's okay. We got to try out the heavy armor. We got to try out the parasitic plasma rifle, which or blaster, which is going to be something that we use way more often. Because it's the most ammo economic weapon. I think it takes food, basically. You, you feed it with food because the... Uh, Stamina going down, it takes food to, to heal that, but we make ration packs pretty quickly. So it's not going to be that big of a deal. I'm going to loot this place, pull out anything that we can possibly use, and then uh, we're going to go hit another one. We've got another one down here that's shielded, which I think might be the drone base. So we might go destroy that. It just depends on... I don't think I can get to it. Well, it depends. Maybe I'll make some more kablammies and we'll we'll mole miner it because I do love to mole miner drone bases. It it entertains the hell out of me. So we'll see if we can do that. But for now, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you did enjoy this episode. If you did, do me a favor, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel for a little bit more content, and uh, leave a comment in the comment section. And as always, everyone, have a great rest of your day.